Hey Salam, I hope you guys are doing well. Halal Chef is back for another video and this time I'm making a mouth-watering recipe for chicken sandwich. Oh man, it's gonna be so good. It's gonna be dipped in, in a mild spicy sauce and the sandwich is gonna be served on a bed of crunchy lettuce, mayonnaise. It's gonna be amazing. Now for those who don't know, I'm a big fan of chicken sandwich. It always gets me. Without further ado, let's get started. All right, first of all, we're gonna pound our chicken breast. I'm using here a greaseproof paper. You could use a bag or a meat tenderizer. I'm just gonna use this today. So I've got here my beautiful chicken breasts. I'm just gonna place them here on this paper, just like so. And grab another sheet. I'm just gonna put that on the top. Grab your rolling pin and we're just gonna start tapping this until they are nice and flat. So I'm using chicken breast today, but you could use chicken thighs. But as you know, chicken breasts and chicken thighs, they both have completely two different textures. Just gonna turn to this other side. I'm gonna keep pounding from this side as well. Just do it nice and slow. You don't wanna like break your chicken. All right, so that's enough. I can see they are doubled in size. Just gonna remove them from this paper now. Just gonna place it here. All right, so just grab your knife. We're just gonna cut it into four fillets, all right? So that's two. three and four. Grab a ball, in with our fillets, in with a teaspoon of black pepper, smoked paprika, cayenne or red chili pepper. Going to finish this off with salt. With the help of a spoon, give this a really good mix. Leave it to the side, grab another ball, Sift through two cups of flour. Now we're going to season our flour. Make sure to season the flour properly. It's very important. I'm gonna start with black pepper. Go two teaspoons of that. A teaspoon of white pepper. A teaspoon of cayenne or red chili. Tablespoon of garlic powder. Don't forget the onion powder. Finish this off with salt. Give this a really good mix. I always tell people to season the flour properly. Should be able to taste your flour. All right, so our chicken is ready. Our flour is done. All we need now is some cold water. Just gonna grab another plate. So this is how it's gonna go. We're gonna first of all grab our fillet. We're just gonna drop it into the flour. Just coat it properly. And then, just gonna drop it into the water for a few seconds. And then, back into the flour. And again, coat it properly. Now if you want, you can coat it twice. Just make sure to shake off the excess flour. And we're gonna fry that off straight away, all right? So there you go. Don't overcrowd, just fry one at a time. Fry this until nice and golden brown. Now it's best if you use a deep pan. The reason for that is your flour sometimes it gets in a darker color. This would avoid that. Keep cooking until it's nice and golden brown and the noise of the frying is disappeared. That's exactly what you're looking for. Beautiful. All right, so I'm gonna carry on, just gonna grab another fillet into the flour, give it a really good mix. 
Now instead of water, you could use buttermilk. You know, it's not a problem. Shake off the excess flour and into the water. Just a few seconds and back into the flour. All right. Give it a really good mix. Shake off the excess flour. Very important. Now it's really good if you can multitask. As soon as you have dipped into the water and to the flour, mm. add it straight into the oil for best results. Mm. All right, so our chicken sandwich looks great. I'm just gonna finish you off with a touch of oregano. I'm just gonna leave it in a warm place until we cook our sauce. Now for the sauce, turn the heat to medium low. Add in a tablespoon of butter and flour. Just gonna cook the rawness of this flour. So when the rawness of the flour is cooked, I'm just gonna start adding in stock slowly. And now we're gonna bring this to simmer. Now when it starts to simmer, I'm just gonna add a half a tablespoon of uh, soy sauce in with hot sauce, season with touch of black pepper, just a touch of salt, touch of paprika powder, and just a touch of onion powder. Give this a really good mix. We're gonna reduce this until it thickens. There's no need to add corn flour. All right, so our sauce is done. It's been simmering for around five minutes. Look at the consistency. All right, so no thicker than this. Done. All right, let's plate this so I'm just gonna get my toasted bun. Gonna add a generous amount of mayonnaise onto there. Got some thinly sliced lettuce. Just gonna add a good amount of that on there. Now before we add our chicken sandwich, I'm just gonna add that sauce into this bowl here. Now in there I'm gonna add in our chicken sandwich. There you go. Just leave it there for a few seconds. Until the sauce submerges on that crust. our beautiful chicken sandwich on the top mm. just a bit more sauce on the top cover this up with the rest of the bun mm. delicious guys I'm gonna try this delicious burger look at it oh man or right, let's try this bismillah mm. wow so so delicious oh man the beautiful sauce the crispiness of the burger oh it's so good so look at that. It's just perfectly made. Two thousand years later. A well cooked chicken sandwich. You gotta try this. Alright guys, thank you for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe, make sure you like, and I'll see you next time. Until then, salam. Big for your mom, big for your dad, big for your family. Enjoy.